Welcome to a demo of series three, and this is what I'm making for Steam. So I need to make video, a, a video or videos on this that shows to the person viewing the store page in just a few seconds what this is all about. So that isn't easy, but I've got some ideas of how to do that. But I thought I'd just show you what what this is all, uh, what is going to be shown anyway. So yes, this is not a pigeon hunting simulator, but you can't shoot the pigeons. Uh, I will show you how that's done, the assets I've used, and why don't I just shoot the barrel and take out lots of them, which is completely silly, but that's not what the point is. The point is to take out the golems out there. So something I need to do, I need to develop in the future, is to make a like a mission system, so that way the player has objectives to complete. Uh, simple ones, I guess. Oops, there are birds in here. That's no good. Let me fix them and rearrange the furniture. Ooh. <laughs> I think that took care of them. Yes, it did. There's the bird right there. Uh, right, so let me see. What can I take to help me against uh, the golems? A table, a chair, ooh, a bed, cooking pot. Yeah, I think that'll work. Wood block. If it was nighttime, the lantern would certainly help. A wood cabinet. Ooh, and some more wood blocks. Can't, can't hurt. And I'll take that uh, explosive barrel and then uh, take care of those golems. So I will show you as well uh, in the future how I've made this terrain. So I've used a uh, really good uh, asset store asset to achieve that. And uh, and how this guy how I've made that to using another asset store asset. And then, of course, how to use the RTP shaders at a basic level to achieve, you know, pretty nice terrain shading with snow and stuff where it's, you can't easily see the texture tiling. Okay, so that's the wood block. Now, what about cabinet? Let me try that. Oh, that worked. Lantern, lantern, no, hopeless. Cooking pot. <laughs> that worked very well. Bed, nope. Chair, yeah, chair worked. Uh, bench, no, that was table. Okay, oh, I'm back down to gun. Uh, and that's just the original block, the square block from the series. I, I rather like the cooking pot. I'm going to use that to take care of them. Oh, it's like a wrecking ball, really. It's quite fun. <laughs> and I suppose that guy can just get taken up the uh, traditional way. Oh, I missed. Ah, oh, well. Done. Okay, so that is the uh, demo scene, and I hope to show you more. I hope to show you like a, um, uh, well, the trailers that I'll use for Steam anyway. So I, I think it's very important to make something that looks really good for a Steam paid store, uh, so that you know it is about trying to sell the uh, sell the piece of software, sell the uh, title itself, or rather catch that attention because a viewer span on attention span on Steam is ridiculously low like it's only a few seconds if you don't capture them in just a few seconds with interesting pictures or uh, the pictures are the most important if you don't capture them with that then you've lost them like uh, even if they would be interested in your title they just won't be because they well there's just so many things to look at there's too many things for a person to look at through the store so that's why it's really important to make something that looks uh, well hopefully pretty good anyway leave your feedback please like what do you think of this do you think this is well good enough to demonstrate a tutorial series a video game development tutorial series I know I, I, well, I, I value your feedback, so uh, please do leave them below. And uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope to keep you updated uh, pretty soon.